Hello, my name is Jack Morgan. This is my development plan for my upcoming game Z Dungeons. I have made this on ClickUp.com. I have created a space and called it a Z Dungeon Game Space. As you can see, I have basically got a board with a recent dots, resources, folders, and lists. The main part of this for me is the lists. As you can see, I have made 10 lists which are aimed towards the 10 most important parts of the game for example playable character development the game environment AI controlled characters development the game opening user interface and all the very important parts game testing very important and then if you click through this you'll notice I have got tasks and then within those tasks I have subtasks what the subtasks are is they are basically add-ons to the original main task. So you can see I've got a draft main character, but then within that I've got draft character name, draft character designs, draft character background, and create two drafts of the character design. So the most important part. I've also got a schedule for when it should be due in. As you can see, these are upcoming dates, so I need to work out the upcoming dates for it. As you can see, I worked it out based on what I thought would be most suitable for each task. I'm going to now go to game environment, which has got a much larger section. As you see, I've tried to make the dates follow on to allow me to work on one task at a time. You see, game environment design and all the tasks that go on the right, draft inside of each room. Create environment and unity, create a navigation map. You will notice all of the dates will follow on. I have also set the end date for the last subtask as the date for the main task because, of course, once that's done, the main task is complete. The main task is basically a title which all the subtasks complete. Or task, or subtasks complete. As you can see, I've got all of these that follow on. I decided to put my user interfaces in the middle of development to mix things up a bit so that I'm not constantly doing the same thing. I could make the user interfaces at any stage, but I thought it would be useful to put it in the middle because it mixes things up a bit. And then you got, of course, at the end, you get the game testing where we do all the testing in the game and then we do all the checks. So that is my development plan. I've also got resources in which I can upload my resources for easy access.